Hello guys, I am back again, still updating you with the breaking trending news what is going on in Nigeria. So good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, depending on your location at this time of the day. All right, guys, um, let me share this video for you guys because uh, this bit of beast movement is no longer funny. And it has been confirmed by um, Obasiki, Godwin Obasiki, uh, that is the Edo State Governor, that almost all the homes in Nigeria... Um, majority they are now obedient yes and then um, he has also confirmed that um, nobody wants to go to the direction of the apc and the uh, pdp okay guys um i don't know what to say but it is more than evangelism the peter obese movement without any embossment sponsors who are the sponsors of this peter obese movement is the question is a knot that is going to be hard for both the APC and the PDP to crack. It's going to be difficult for them to crack the knot because if they have the opportunity to crack this knot, believe me, these guys will crack the knot. Remember what happened during NSAS movement? Yes, if these guys know the, the, the grassroots, the roots of this knot of obedience, these guys will look for any alternative. They will look for every Everything they would do, everything possible to make sure they crack this knot. All right, listen to Obasiki. Let me know what you guys think. Make sure you share to others. See you guys in another update. Future of our politics in this country is changing. I don't know how you are, whether you are closely watching what is going on. The level of disenchantment with the existing parties. I'm sure in all our homes here, we have so many people now who call themselves obedience. I don't know whether you have them in your house. Just ask them, where are you? Which party are you for? They say obedience. <laughs> Do you understand? They don't want us. They, do, they are not talking about APC or PDP. They are looking for alternatives. And they are, men, they are much, much more. You see all of them queuing for PVCs now. They are not looking the direction of APC or PDP. They are looking for alternatives. And if we don't curb this, if we don't make our party attractive, I do not know what will happen in the next election.